Y'all, subscribe to my man's channel because you will not regret it. <laughs> Dang. Ready for this? Yeah, but you're in my way. All right. <laughs> <laughs> We're doing different video style here today. I, this time, instead of me teaching you, I am gonna teach my wife, my better looking half, better looking, more intelligent, and oh come on, all around, the flattery. But I know more about animation and about Blender. That is for sure. Have you ever used Blender before? And no. Okay. What well, are we gonna do? It. What are we gonna animate? Sweet car. But brand new rig from my brand new website, motionblendstudio.com. You can download the car asset that we're gonna be using in this. And this is fully rigged, fully textured, ready to go. Beautiful. So uh, we're gonna jump into it. And this is, we're going from zero to hero in this, because she's never used Blender before. Yes. How are you feeling about it? Feeling good. All right, Why let's do it. Should. All right, step one. Open up Blender. <laughs> okay. Is this a real creature? Comment in the comments if you think Brittany's face should be in this <laughs> no. Don't do that. All right, so uh, just click, click once. Okay, and this part is very Delete important. Delete the Press. cube. She, she already knows. <laughs> okay, so you actually press X. Not X. delete. No, this is blender. And then X again. It doesn't have to make sense. No. You have to click it. All right, let's just make a very simple rudimentary road. So okay. add a plane. Oh, I'll just do that. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, asset type. Mm, nope, not that one. You do, right. you always what's, do the shortcut. Yeah, what's the thing I always say? Command P. <laughs> <laughs> do you? Well, I mean, that is a thing. What does Command P do? Uh, that can parent something. Or Shift D. Shift D is duplicate. Okay. Do shift A. Shift A. Mesh plane. That's what we want, right? There you go. And I can make it bigger. How do you do that? You always do make it look like, nope, not like that. You could use one of these things, but no one ever uses those unless you're a Maya, I don't, Maya user. I don't want, I want to do it the blender way. Right. Which is shortcuts. Yes. So tell me all the shortcuts. S. Just S. S. And For then sh scale. <laughs> and then what? Arrows? No, you can just drag. What, you can? Hey, how about that? What, you didn't know You're that? teaching me now. <laughs> well, there's just arrows on there. Okay, we need it big, right? How big is this space? Well, we don't know, because we don't have the car in there yet. All right, that's fine. What's this thing? That's a, that's a light. Let's delete this that. This is a light? That's a camera. Oh, yeah, that's right. Delete Del the light? Yeah. X? Yeah. So, select the road. You want to go into edit mode. Oh, yes. Yep, edit try mode. that one. Okay. Edit. Okay, now you're in edit mode. Transform. Do control R. That'll create loop cuts. This is adding geometry. See? Huh? How about that? I didn't see do how anything. it adds. Well, it's like preemptive. So if you click, it'll add an edge right there or wherever oh, you slide. I see. Okay. So what is that line for? So if we wanted to like say extrude a middle face down and have there be a little lip on the edge for a road, maybe. You want to see it from top down view? Press the tilde key. Tilde? I don't think it's tilde. Like in Spanish on the in, like inye? I think it's called the tilde. I didn't say it was Spanish. It is though. <laughs> <laughs> See this cool little pie menu? Oh, top. Yeah. Now you have three faces there. Oh, I see. It just split this off. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then you could like orbit. Nope, not If like you that. want middle mouse. And then orbit around. Push, like push and hold the middle mouse. Oh, I see. Push and hold. Yeah, see? And now you're out of top view. That's weird. Ugh. That's not very easy. Ugh. <laughs> I'm pushing and just scrolling. Just like put like that. Just, it's real organic. All right. Oh, well, yeah, like that. That's great. Okay. All right. What do you think this short fa short <laughs> <laughs> shortcut for extrude is? Uh, command E. No, it never makes sense. It's like command T or command <laughs> Q or something. <laughs> they never, it's not like extrude starts with E. It's E. No. It is actually E. It is? <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. Command E? No, just E. Extrude. E. And you can extrude down or up. Oh wow, so it like I can no. make a pool. <laughs> How do I go to object mode? You can press tab or the, yeah, there you go. Add a modifier and choose array. It got long. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I think we're gonna get comments about this one. <laughs> 
Okay, so a road. All right. Yeah. Okay, so there we're done. Done with a road? No yeah. lines on the... Just click and open image. Oh, click. Oh, I see. Yep. There you did. You did it. Where is it? <laughs> <laughs> huh. I like it on there. Can I keep it on there? Sure. Now, append the car. Appendage. <laughs> Shameless plug here. Take it away. There's a beautiful, gorgeous car, fresh on the market, that you are going to want to practice this animating skill for yourself. It's That's right. beautiful. That's right. High quality, rigged, textured. You didn't know this was all a commercial. Um, what else is it? It's a sweet rig. That you're going to use for the first time. <laughs> Here we go. So don't say it's sweet yet until oh, I've words. seen it though. It is sweet. All right, let's append it. All right, easy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So now tab. Our child is banging on something <laughs> very loud out there. No promo. Doge to the moon. <laughs> <laughs> you notice that, huh? So Matt has everything selected, and you can actually scale and rotate in this position if you wanted to. As an aside. If you select this, you could alter this and make it look like it had a crash because you can isolate it. Mm -hmm. Okay, three on the Z. Nope, that's not <laughs> it either. <laughs> y is supposed to be up and down. Z should be... Hey, this, this, this is how Blender does things. So. All right. Well, and Maya, yes, you're right, but Blender's better. I so. want negative three. Yes. I just, just say I, you're probably the only person in the world that It's does important it like that. to me, okay? It's fine. It's interesting. That's great. Okay, what's next? Go <laughs> <laughs> oh, check out this one. This? Uh huh. <laughs> Anime, let's have the. <laughs> Whoa. Did I do something bad? No. Why are those green lines there? Blender's just like, hey, you want to move it on this axis? Yeah, axis. Axis. <laughs> I've heard both ways. <laughs> You've heard a lot of things both ways. I heard this Escape. was a good video once. <laughs> if you want to just animate the car, so you already know. <laughs> yes. Okay. Do you know how to pre do you know how to set a keyframe in Blender? Nope. Take a guess. Set a keyframe. Keyframe is the yeah it's... the key to animation. Yes, it's... I remember this. College. Okay. <laughs> keyframe. <laughs> Your college. Keyframe, keyframe. She, she did not go to animation. School. And it helps you. It like fills in the gaps. Or Maya does that. Blender does that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're thinking of how when you set a keyframe and then you yeah. set another keyframe, it'll fill in the computer gaps. Computer animation for you. will automatically yeah. fill in the gaps. Yeah. So, but to do that, you have to first set one keyframe. Key yeah. yeah. But I so don't know how to do, to do that. Take a guess. Command I. You're so close. <laughs> It. Just I. Oh, it is? <laughs> How am I so good at <laughs> guessing? Okay, so, you, so now you can set a keyframe on the location, rotation, scale of it. Which one do you want? Which location one do you want? You're animating this. You're, you're keyframing the location of this control, which is what the whole car is parented to. Uh, so do you see that yellow dot there? That's our keyframe number our one. Key frame. So then what? These are just markers it doesn't uh -huh. mean you have to have a keyframe yeah. every 10. right okay so you can just go to another keyframe or another frame and set another key so if i want frame five i mean that's that's a lot try like a hundred okay key one. you can also just click oh i can just click the number mm -hmm. ah, all right okay here we go all right there now i want another keyframe <gasps> I animated something? That was like way too easy. <laughs> oh, uh, Disney? Yeah. yeah <laughs> okay, so if I want to make it donut slash U turn, mm -hmm. I need this yep. tail. Mm -hmm. And to rotate R. <laughs> what do you even need me for? <laughs> so if I push play, it'll play it. Yeah. Love it. Thanks for teaching me. So great. Yeah, so if you want to do lighting and rendering, then 
you know, that's a few hours of another video. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, easy. I don't know anything about Blender, and this really wasn't that hard. I give two thumbs way, way up. The, what do you think of Blender overall, not just the car? I mean, it's hard, but it, it, it's not something that's like, oh man, I could never figure this out. It would take me yeah. a long time. All the key codes is... Are you going to go back watch all my tutorials now? Yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. yeah. But I love them. All right, everyone. Sports car rig officially available on motionblendstudio.com. Link in the description. And uh, we'll run some sort of sale. I'm not so sure what kind of sale we're going to run, but... There will be a sale. All right, so download the rig, check it out. Um, that My was first good. animation ever. Ever, we should save this. Say we should make that an NFT. Oh dear. 